Um, but, you know, Jamie and I have to play a lot of stuff in the shows um, that really were not meant to be played on guitar, you know, uh, to begin with. Even songs like Peaches on Regalia, you think of that as a melody that you can sing along to. It might still have some complicated rhythms in it, but, you know, when you have to sit there and actually play it, uh, it's a lot harder than it sounds, wouldn't you say, Jamie? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, there's one part that's in three-part harmony, and you know, obviously, there's only two of us, so we would have to play that that part, um, just the, the two pieces. But if uh, the part that that you play, uh, when I recorded a version of it on on one of my records, I played all the parts, and the part that you currently play was my favorite of all of them. You know, in uh, even more than the actual uh, lead melody, which you hear more on the record. But uh, if if you don't mind being put on the spot, you know, play play that little part. <laughs> okay, now that's the harmony to the melody, you know, and that part is is it just sounds great as what that is. Uh, the main melody, which I might be too loud for you. So that one, that's the main thing you hear, but when you hear them together, So, now that right there, that's some, that's some amazing sounding music written in 1968, coming out in 1969. And, you know, that, that wasn't supposed to be played on guitar. It was played on horns and, and, and uh, some organs and stuff. Um, but just to be able to have written something like that, you know, that's the thing. At being a musician, you say, well, if I never did anything else, I wrote that, you know? <laughs> and, and that's just one of the things that Frank wrote that, you know, you just go, wow, how do you even come up with that? You know, and, and that's just one little part of that song. Uh, interesting to know also um, that song, Peaches on Regalia, the original uh, version of it that none of you have ever heard because you've only heard just what came out on the record, had an eight-minute blues jam in the middle of it, if you can believe it. And that part never came out. <laughs> 